Hey everyone, it's Emily and today we are building a cute little cottagey house that's very typical me, I would say. <laughs> and I used to build a lot of these and I would do them every Sunday, but my schedule's been kind of weird recently because I kind of just have been in the mood to build different things and if I'm really in the mood to build something, I feel like it's better to just do that and it'll turn out a lot better than forcing myself to do something that sticks to a schedule. But anyway, I know a lot of you guys like these, so we're, we're getting back into it and I feel like I have built a similar house to this except that this one has this thing on the back. I don't really know what to call it, but it's this like weird octagonal shape jutting out the back. I don't know, but that makes it a little more interesting, right? <laughs> because I've built on this lot so many times. It's my favorite lot to build on. And I don't know, I had a lot of fun with this house and I did almost the entire house like a month ago. And then I realized that I never finished it and I still had the bedroom and the bathroom to do. So I finished that last week and now it's finally making its way onto the channel. So that's cool. <laughs> but this was supposed to go up yesterday. So it would have kind of gone more with my Sunday a cottage build thing that I've got going, which um, you guys probably don't really care about if you're watching this in the future because it's not going to line up anyway. But yeah, since I used to do these always on Sunday, I was thinking like, oh, I'll put this on Sunday and it'll be like throwback to when this was actually a thing, even though it's kind of not anymore, but it's okay. Uh, but I had that all planned and everything was ready to go except the voiceover. And then I just kind of made last minute plans with my friend Zistel on YouTube and she ended up being in my area or like my state uh, for the weekend because in the US, this is Memorial Day weekend. Today's Memorial Day. And um, yeah, she ended up being in my area visiting her, um, her like in-laws, I guess. And so we decided to meet up and that was really cool and fun. And then after I got home, I was like, eh, I really don't want to work on something because we talked about like, um, just like random stuff. And then also like YouTube stuff and like Sim stuff. And one of the last things we talked about was like how excited we are for seasons and seeing the seasons trailer makes me want to play the game again so much because it looks like they have a lot of like really cool gameplay stuff. And Honestly, I'm not too sure what type of build stuff they have because they didn't really show that off quite as much. I saw a lot of decorations and things, but I didn't see too many like key features that I thought were cool build items other than glass roofs, but those are gonna be in a patch. So that's not really like a seasons thing. Um, but yeah, I wasn't too like blown away, which I'm not mad about, but I didn't see any cool like build stuff that super stood out to me. So being when I think about that pack, I'm not really excited to build with it. I mean, I kind of am, but I'm also I'm like way more excited to play the game now. And I haven't played the game in such a long time. And we were talking about that and I was like, OK. And then I just went home and I played the game like for the rest of the day. Like I just started a new current household. We might have an update on that soon since I've been playing that a lot. And yeah, we'll see how it goes. But that's what I'm thinking. And anyway, back to the house. I don't I, I talk about this in every video, I feel like, but I never know if I should talk about the house more or the build more, or talk about the house or the build more, talk about the house or talk about random things because I know different people like different things and I've never seen like a clear consensus, at least on my channel, of like people wanting one or the other. I don't really get too many complaints on what I talk about. Every now and then someone says something, but usually like that happened a bunch when I was sick and people didn't realize that I was sick, but that's okay. Anyway, moving on. Um, I really like the inside of this house though. It's very bright and colorful. And like I said, I built everything except the bedroom and the bathroom like over a month ago. So going back into it was really weird and I kind of forgot what I did, but I've edited the footage and stuff. So now I remember what I was doing. Um, I actually edited the footage kind of like last week though. So maybe I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know, we'll see. But I played around with a lot of the Jungle Adventure stuff. I, I can't get over the fridges from Jungle Adventure. They're like my favorite thing. Like that is, I want that fridge in my real life house, please. Thank you. Um, also, I'm really into tiny houses again because Zistel lives in a tiny house or they're like in the process of um, finishing their tiny house. And I, I just really want to live in a tiny house again. <laughs> I went through this whole huge tiny house phase, like 
two years ago probably and I'm back there. I'm back there 100%. I've been on Pinterest 24-7 since, well 24-7, it hasn't even been like 24 hours since I saw her, but <laughs> pretty much I've been on, I've been playing The Sims and then on my other monitor I've been like scrolling through Pinterest and looking at tiny house things and playing like tiny house YouTube videos in the background and that's been my life for the past, yeah, like pretty much 24 hours is that <laughs> because I'm, I don't know, I just love the idea of living in a tiny house and owning a house and not having to pay rent is really appealing because I don't really want to move in, like I don't think it makes sense to buy a house somewhere if you're not sure if you're going to live there for a long time. It's as like a young person out of school. So most people just rent a house or, or like an apartment or whatever, depending on where they are, but a tiny house seems like the way to go because you save so much money and it's you get your little cute tiny house and you get to like customize it and uh, I love the idea of living in a tiny house so much. Okay, it's gonna happen. It's a thing. It's it's a thing again. Um, I kind of want to like build a million tiny houses in The Sims now and it's not even funny, but it's okay. We'll, if we just go through like a huge tiny house phase on the channel, that's why you're getting the insider info right now that that might happen. <laughs> I really want, I have this idea, maybe I shouldn't share all my ideas before I do them because if I take a long time to act on them, maybe someone else will do them, I don't know. I always hear people talking about that, but I don't think that I've, I mean, maybe I've just never seen someone else like take my idea, but <laughs> I'm sure it happens to people. But anyway, um, I was trying to use that movie hangout stuff table because for the longest time it wasn't working. Like it only had one swatch and you couldn't go to any of the other ones, even though it showed that you had other swatches selected and it was so frustrating because I like that table but I think at the time I was building this that glitch had just been fixed so I was like oh maybe I'll use this table it works again and then I was like going through all the swatches and I was like mm, this doesn't fit here so I went with the glass one and I've realized that I used those yellow chairs from laundry day I used those in another build and that other build is probably gonna be on the channel later this week but it has a very similar color scheme to this especially on the outside so I'm pretty probably gonna try to space it out a little bit because they look so similar and like I said I built this like over a month ago and the other house or it's not a house it's a restaurant but that makes it a little different but I built that like very recently so I wasn't even thinking about this when I built that and they just ended up having a very very similar color scheme and I think it's just because they have a lot of like white brick on the outside and then they also have lots they both have lots of like sunflowers and like yellow flowers so they have a very similar like white and yellow vibe going on so we're gonna try to spread spread them out a little bit hope you guys like yellow <laughs> i said something when i figured that out i tweeted um if you don't follow me on twitter you should but <laughs> anyway i tweeted and i said something like i realized that i made two builds with the exact same color scheme hope you guys like yellow i mean that's what i just said so i don't know why i felt like i should repeat myself because i basically just said the same thing here but i don't know just you should follow me on twitter <laughs> i don't know this voiceover is such a mess i feel like all my voiceovers are now because i do them very quickly and also my videos have been much shorter recently I feel like just because I since I have a full-time job for the summer I don't have as much time to do stuff so my energy level is like when I'm actually at a good energy level to record voiceovers is much less often than it used to be so I feel like they're shorter and then I talk fast I mean I talk fast all the time I have always been told that anyway but I don't know what I'm saying. Um, I just feel like they're more all over the place because I know that it's a shorter video and if I have a bunch of things I want to say, I don't know where I'm going to fit them all in, but that's okay. We're doing it. We're, we're getting there. But this is like the last little part of the build that I finished before I took my break and came back to it um, a million years later, but I really like this and I also really like using tables as desks because they make it so that you can put more stuff on the desk without having to, you know, like, I think I'm about to do it, but you like pull the thing away and then you like move the object with alt and like you have to rearrange stuff. You don't have to do that quite as much when you do it on a table instead of a desk because dining tables have more slots on them. So the little items will have a bunch more places and like angles that you can put them at. Whereas if you just have a desk, there are only so many slots for items on that. I don't know if that makes any sense, but that's why I like using tables as desks sometimes. But I have an issue every now and then. I don't know if it's just with the tables as desks or if it's with all computers. I don't know if this is a common glitch. So like, 
don't come for me if it is. I have no idea. That's why I'm asking. <laughs> but um, yeah, I have this issue sometimes where I'll tell my sim to do something on the computer and they say they can't reach it. But if I click on the chair that's by the computer first and have them sit there and then have them use the computer, they can use it. And it's very frustrating because it's like one extra like step I have to do to micromanage them. I can't just like queue up a bunch of actions and let them be, which is what I prefer to do. But I don't know, it's kind of annoying. But let me know if you have that issue. If it's a common glitch, I would also like to know because that means that they're probably gonna fix it soon, you know? So that would be cool. And it's really funny, but I've heard someone else say this before too. I think it was Kristen Marie XO, if you watch her videos, but I'm pretty sure she said one time when she was building that she listens to podcasts podcasts a lot when she builds and when she watches her build back she can remember what was being talked about in the podcast I think she said that I don't know she might not have might have made that up um because I was trying to find someone to relate with me but I was watching a story time video when I was doing this part of the build specifically and it was about this girl that had a terrible roommate and she was talking about how she, it was in a house where she was basically like renting the one room and they just shared like the kitchen and living area and then the other girl had been living there beforehand and she was just talking about how terrible of a roommate she was and she was like much older than her and all the stuff but she was like very irresponsible and basically she got like kicked out of the place and I think they only lived together for like two months I don't know why I'm telling you this but it was very interesting <laughs> And it's so funny when I watch these back and I can remember exactly what thing I was watching or listening to when I did certain things. Um, if I'm listening to music, that doesn't happen quite as much because it's just kind of like a blur of songs that I'm not fully listening to. But if I'm listening to someone tell a story or a certain video or I'm watching a show or something, I can remember what was happening. <laughs> And like there was another house that I built recently and the whole time I was building that house, I was like binge watching um, Emma Chamberlain. I think she's really funny, um, but I just found her recently and I was just like watching all of her videos because I just found her like that day <laughs> randomly. And uh, that whole house is just like, I was, as I was doing the voiceover, I was constantly remembering like what was going on in her vlog or whatever as I was building. So that was interesting, but I don't know. Let me know if you guys make videos and if that ever happens to you when you go back to edit them. Like, can you remember what you were watching if you watch stuff while you build? I don't know. Or if you, even if you don't make videos, I would be interested if you build your own stuff or like even while you're playing the game, do you do something else while you're playing? Like, do you listen to music? Do you um, like watch YouTube in the background? Do you watch Netflix? Like, what do you do? I want to know. I'm curious because I used to just play the game and not do anything else, like zero multitasking. And then I realized that it got boring so I started listening to music but anyway we're on to the screenshots I hope you guys enjoyed this super rambly mess video um but yeah that's all I've got so I hope you're having a great day and thanks for watching bye